To another video so as you can see I'm wearing some basically this is a mp3 player I can wear this in the pool and swim and I can tell you for a fact that it works this that you see right here is an mp3 this is the mp3 player it's got the big play button so to turn it off you just hold down this button and to turn it on you you press the big button in the middle, the play button, hold it down, it'll turn on, all right? There'll be a blinking light. What you do is, as you can see, I take it out very slowly, carefully, because I don't want this end to get wet. It acts like a USB stick. You plug this into your laptop, or whatever computer, and it'll show up as like a, a USB stick drive. And then you just plop all your music, podcasts, whatever, media you want to listen to into this thing okay but make sure that you plug it in this direction facing up okay I tried to put it this direction facing up and it didn't work okay because as you can see the metal rails that connect with your computer is down underneath this also charges the mp3 player once you plug it into your computer so once you're ready you stick it into this socket right here like so okay and then you just clip it in and there you go, there's your mp3 player. As you can see, it connects into these guys. And you can see this, this is the waterproof version of the earphone. So this is the, the regular earphone. And this is the modified waterproof version of it that you clip on. And that goes into your ear as you swim. Here, it's like a hairband. It's very tight, okay? It's gonna wrap around your skull, as you can see. You can't wear it down here. You can try if you want, but it's, it's going to choke your neck. See, it's very tight. All right, so the instruction manual says So you can hear that? <laughs> it has a pretty good volume range. Okay, so by the way, the volume rockers are top and bottom. So this is more volume, less volume down here, okay? And then left and right are next song, previous song. Plug it in, both ears. I don't know if you can see if it's on properly or not, okay? Then I put the sim cap on top of that. That's the thing about putting any obstruction into your ear canals on top of a swim cap is that you put it in the wrong way and it will be very painful. So, you ready to play the music? Goggles on. A few things that I noticed about this guy is that one it does work okay the audio is crystal clear but the thing is when you're swimming in water like i am like for example doing front crawl you're doing laps you're going to be competing with the sound of the water itself if you are a swimmer you know what i'm talking about you're you're dealing with that rush of whoosh, whoosh. washing machine sound of water that, that it, it's you can't it's unavoidable you will probably have to adjust your volume accordingly so you probably have to make it a little bit louder than normal in order to compete with that that whooshing sound other than that it's fine you can listen to a podcast it's crystal clear you can hear the voice talking do i recommend this product yes of course i do if you're a long time swimmer you'll know that doing laps back and forth in a pool is pretty monotonous it's pretty boring after time because You've learned your skills, you've already sharpened it already, all you have to do is just put in the work, you know, like do 20 to 60 minutes of laps, 
you get your exercise in and then you're out. If you're learning though, if you're a newbie, then you should be focusing on learning how to swim first, okay? But for the rest of us that already know how to do our breaststroke, already know how to do our front crawl, know, already know how to do our laps consistently back and forth, this is a game changer because this is going to eliminate some of that tedious boredom that you, you know, you know what I'm talking about, you just, you get stuck in the zone and you just listen to that drone of water whooshing past you, it gets kind of boring. Pick this up on Amazon like I did, I will leave a link to this product down below. I get a lot of curious swimmers <laughs> come up to me and ask me how it works and all that and I think it's pretty cool, it's pretty high tech. As you can see, I do not recommend wearing this in the gym. This is not really a good gym Bluetooth earphone. It doesn't connect with your iPhone either, so be aware of that. You're going to have to take take the, the USB out of this thing and then plug it into your computer every time you want to add or remove songs. So be wary of that, okay? So this is not a substitute for your iPhone Bluetooth headset that you have, like those Jaybirds. But this is pretty cheap compared to those, because this, I got on Amazon for about 50 bucks Canadian. If you want to spice in your swimming up, then yeah, pick these bad boys up. And if you want to learn how to swim, check out my swimming course, 7 dayswimco where I give you the game plan on learning how to swim from A to Z. If you are a complete newbie, or if you want a refresher course, or improve your breaststroke, or your front crawl, this course of mine, 7 dayswimco covers all of that from very simple steps that you can learn, learn right now. Click the link below, get instant access for that. And if you have more questions for me or other swimmers, join our free Facebook group. Join the link down below, absolutely free. And you have no excuse now, okay? You got something to entertain you, you got a swimming course that teaches you, and you got me to subscribe to. That's all I have to say for now. Until next time, I'll see you later, okay? Bye-bye.